Hey everyone, it's Rob. Tonight we're going to be chatting about how to make mind maps with ChatGPT. And you'll need these three things, a ChatGPT account, a mind mapping software like XMind, and Notepad, WordPad, Word, something to write documents in. Let's go ahead and open up ChatGPT. So with ChatGPT open, I'm going to put in this prompt. Uh, so this prompt is just a just a generic digital transformation for customer support uh, with AI. I can imagine a lot of these are coming down the pipeline. And the important thing with the end of this prompt is that we have, please provide a code box with a markdown language. Now this is important because what we'll be wanting to do later is export this markdown language uh, and put it into a, a program that will make it a bit more visual. Now, of course, if we want it to be just, you know, um, yeah, just kind of like bullet points that we could use for a PowerPoint PowerPoint presentation. We can remove the the code uh, the code box, but um, yeah, let's make it visual. That's fun, at least I think so. So going back to our code box, what we want to do is copy the code, and then we want to open up Notepad or some sort of word processing thing, and we just want to save what we have done. Now, when we save it, we want to change the file to a .md. And there's one last step. What we want to do is we want to open up our mind mapping program. For me, I chose XMind. And then in XMind, we can go ahead and click File, Import, and then a Markdown document. And we will find our mind map, which we uh, named mindmap.md. That's important. And then, da da da, drum roll, voila. Great. So here we have it. We have our Beautiful, gorgeous mind map. We can, of course, take a screenshot of this if we want to and put it in a deck. Um, edit if we don't want it to look like all of the colors of the wind. Um, yeah. And there you have it. Easy peasy. So that's it for me. Happy mind mapping. Uh, wishing everybody a wonderful Friday night. For those that have friends and are not at home making chat GPT videos in their office, um, I digress. Have a wonderful weekend and I will catch you with the news update on Sunday. Take care.